All right, so starting things off with my breakfast, you know, two eggs. I do not like eating something too big in the morning. You know, I just I just feel like saving my calories later uh, for nighttime when I'm the most hungry is the best. And also, I don't just like to get too full during the morning. I don't know if you guys are the same. And then as you guys already know, I had a you know little boo boo at work and really messed up my shoulder and my knee. As you guys can see, I could barely lift off my arm. This is uh, during therapy, so I wasn't even, uh, I couldn't lift any weights, and this is me now. Uh, I was able to maintain a lot of muscle, and it's due to these meals and recipes that I'm going to show you at the rest of this video. Uh, so definitely, guys, if you guys want to see some you know good, fast results, give these meals a try. They're very simple and fast to make. Uh, starting off, uh, you know, like in the morning, I'll have my eggs or I'll have, you know, some peanut butter and jelly, but some strawberries and uh, some blueberries just to get me nice and energized for the gym. After it, I'll have this right here. It's just a protein shake. I'll use whole milk and a little bit of water not to go too crazy with calories. Uh, I use two scoops. Uh, that's the levels weight protein. And then I'll add some some kale just to get some veggies in. It's real quick, uh, very easy, uh, you know, post workout shake. You don't have to have this. Sometimes I'll have the I'll have white rice and chicken right after the gym. So depending on your day, the order does not really matter. It's just what's most convenient to you. And then moving on to chicken. Usually I like to cook uh, 16 ounces of raw chicken breast, and you know I just like chopping it up in little pieces. And this it goes by really quick it cooks so much faster when they're in smaller pieces so you will save a lot a lot of time and depending on how you want to wash it you know you could use apple cider vinegar you could use regular vinegar water uh, some people don't wash it at all it's all the it's all preference and i usually have three meals including for the rest of the day including chicken uh, depending on your preference as far as uh what kind of meats you like just remember it's not just chicken breast uh, you could try tuna uh, any type of fish salmon uh, you know you could try lean ground beef lean ground turkey there's a lot of options when it comes to different meats so if you get tired you could definitely play around with that and switch it up now as far as the cooking oils if you're using extra virgin olive oil just make sure that you are weighing it if you're using way too much uh, I've seen some people use an extreme amount, you know, not most of it is not going to go in, you know, the chicken is not going to absorb it. But if you go a little too crazy and you're eating an extra 150 uh, calories per meal, uh, that's going to put you back up at your maintenance weight. So you will be maintaining your weight instead of seeing, you know, uh, fat loss. So definitely pay attention to those calories. If you're struggling, you know, just make sure that you're not getting extra calories from somewhere else. That's why a food skill is so good to use. Uh, I like to, you know, put my chicken in a glass container and just have it in the fridge. So whenever I need to eat again, it's just so quick and easy. I only like to cook one time, one time a day. You could do the same thing for the rice. You could use brown rice or white rice. I like using brown rice at nighttime, uh, not to spike my insulin too much. Uh, sometimes I'll, I'll have white rice and chicken right uh, right after the gym instead of the shake. And somewhere in between, I'll have another plate of uh, rice and chicken. Uh, sometimes I'll go for five ounces, three ounces, four ounces, depending what my total calories are. Uh, but uh, it, also, if you guys are using a lot of sauces, like I like ketchup but when i use ketchup i just you know make sure that i don't weigh it like but i know most or most or what like the amount that i'd be using all the time so i don't have to weigh it uh but like i said if you guys are struggling maintaining i mean losing weight you guys are stuck uh make sure that they're not hitting calories in your diet because i don't want you to be dieting for weeks on weeks being stuck at the same weight but you're also eating extra calories somewhere else uh, for example, like uh, in your vegetables, if you're using extra virgin olive oil or, you know, ranch dressing, things like that, it all adds up. Uh, so, yeah, I just have this meal about three times a day. Uh, switch it up a little bit. Maybe I'll add some beans on the next one. And, but I always use ketchup because I have to have that flavor. But anyways, guys, that's just the current meals that I was eating. And hopefully you guys liked it. 
Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time. Hold on to the channel and like, subscribe.